Bro, I can't believe I'm about to do what I'm about to do. Mmm. 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 Oh, it better be worth it. Oh, it better be worth it. Oh, Cade. Cade, it better be worth it. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, why did I just delete a character just to do this? Oh, my God. Oh, well, yeah, welcome, everybody. I know that was kind of a long little intro, but yeah, uh, for second campaign, I'm here to play it. Now, with the Witch Queen, unfortunately, they do have to vault some stuff. And one of those things being the greatest campaign in Destiny history. For second campaign was the start for, honestly, a lot of players. It was very monumental. I mean, considering the death of everyone's basically favorite character in the game. Um, so, yeah, I'm here to relive it one last time before it goes away for... For maybe not forever, but until it goes away for now. But first things first, let me uh, uh let's let's get a little inventory change real quick. There we go. That looks a lot better. And you know I had to put Ace of Spades on for this. How do I even start it? Do I just click on this? Oh, here we go, dude. I oh I gotta do. Why did I have to do Bungie? Why don't make us delete characters for campaigns in the future? Dude, I gotta go to the Beyond Light campaign again to get my stasis subclass. Oh, this better be worth it. Oh, this better be this better be worth it. This might be the first time that like I'm actually happy to see K die. Like that I want to see K die. This, dude, I haven't done this campaign since it probably came out. I mean, because I had to do it on all three characters when it came out, and I haven't done it since because you can't replay it. So shit, dude. Oh, I'm about to see him die. Man, dude. Oh, this shot looks so cool. This is awkward, hey? Hey, you got a gun I can borrow? No. But I do have a bullet. <laughs> this is going to hurt. Is he going to say the thing? He's going to say it. Any last words? Oh, here it is. <coughs> How's your sister? Dude, that's one way to go out though. I mean, the last thing you say before you die is that you you the, your killer's sister. That's pretty tough. I ain't gonna lie. That's pretty tough. Mmm, look at us. That's the screenshot right there. That's a wallpaper. Petra Bench. Thanks for the invite. What you packing for this party? Uh, the usual. Oh, do the thing. Seriously, watch this. <laughs> Dude, how, how do I not remember this part? <laughs> It'll never not freak me out. They again. really did though Later. on the last mission that you ever Maybe. see with Kate. They really did right pack now, all his comedy light. really into it. Like they Don't made this mean, mission just all about Kate's personality. Lockdown. But if the core security systems fail, containment is going to be a problem. Dude, I love just Petra too, bro. And I'm afraid she's gonna die in Witch Queen. I'm gonna be so upset right, and have to relive the, the sadness I'm living six. right now. Watch me. Dude, this, I'm getting major flashbacks, bro, of when I first played Forsaken. Dude, how long? When, well, that was what? 2018, right? Yeah, because 2019 was Shadowkeep, 2020 was Beyond Light. Dude, this brings back memories. This area looks so cool, too. We're literally in the prison of elders. Like, they just did this mission right. Just the whole atmosphere, just the sounds, like everything. Like, this is peak... Peak Destiny storytelling right here. And then and then they give a shit like Shadow Keep and Beyond Light storytelling. Well, I shouldn't say storytelling, but campaign. Like, how do you go from this to that, dude? Like, how do you screw up that bad? Doesn't he oh dude, doesn't he ride on one of the shanks eventually? Check the high value prisoners down 
She just stabbed the absolute shit out of you. No, Petra, no, don't leave me. Did they really make him say that before he dies? He just said he's having the time of his life. That's wild. Whoever wrote that on the Bungie storytelling team, they're going to hell. <laughs> Bro! I don't remember him saying all this shit. Oh, this is gonna make me so sad. Wasn't this difficult though too? Like like when for when for second first came out your first playthrough of this was this difficult? I'm trying to rem I don't remember what the actual like what level you were when you did this. Good shit, Gade. Good shit. They're all red. Ah, there it is. Dude, that reminds me of you guys ever been to Dave and Buster's and they have the one game where it's like you stand there and you have a bunch of lights around you and you have to like press them all when they light. Holy sh! Why did that just give me like a, a a fever dream of that playing that as a kid going to Dave and Buster's? That is insane. One shot does that? I didn't know the firefly explosion was that big on this thing. Doesn't he shoot the shit out of it? Yeah. That's bullshit. You cannot use Ace of Spades like that. That is bullshit. I agree, kid. We're a great team. At least for the next 20 minutes until you die. But yeah, we're a great team. Dude, they why do they have to foreshadow every every piece of dialogue just foreshadows us getting out of this alive? What like what mm, they just they're just tugging at our heartstrings, man. Looks like we're all done and dusted here, kiddos. Ramen's on me. Mm, no, bro, stop. Stop making it seem like we're all good. Looking pretty good down here. Just gotta check one last thing. And also, we need to get Petra new weapons, bro. That She's been using that Beshian Dynasty since D1. Get some new shit, bro. We just got a Galahorn. Use that. I'll let you borrow mine. No, 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 no. Cade, he's gone. This isn't a prison riot. It's a prison break. The airlock on deck zero. It's the only way out this far down. They're going to escape. Not if I get there first. I love you, Cade. But God, this was some of the most dumb shit I've ever seen a video game character ever do. It's really dope. And it was really cool, but... Okay. Holy shit, was it a dumbass move. Yeah, if only it was that easy, Kate. If only it was that easy. 
I said, back in your cages! Bro, once again, Ace of Spades don't work like that, but it's still so badass though, so I can't complain. I respect that. Dude, is there a, a cooler video game character death than this? Like, was there any other character in video game history that went out like on a, as a like as good of a bang like as this? Oh, don't do it, kid. Don't pull out that ghost. Oh, don't do it. Oh, don't do it. Oh, don't do it. Oh, he's getting fucked up. Team would be proud. No, oh, is that really all you got? You just had to mock him, bro. Now you about to ask your ghost for some help. so sad bro oh i'm coming home ace oh i can't handle it i'm gonna cry i'm gonna cry oh don't say it bro don't say i'm coming home ace don't say it oh i'm literally about to cry holy shit oh, oh. I forgot how sad this shit is, dude. This shit is sad as fuck. It's happening down there. Oh, dude, Come no. And then doesn't it f flash or some shit saying, oh, Kate's ghost must be, oh, dude. Damn, this is when we first get introduced to the scorn. I just, re wow, I just realized that this is our first, literally first time seeing the scorn. The scorn very quickly after this became my least favorite enemy to fight against in this entire game. The Scorn are annoying as shit. Also, I didn't find out you can shoot the lanterns on these guys until literally maybe two months ago. And I, I feel like so bad for it. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's his light gone. What the fuck? Oh shit. Doesn't this start a cutscene? Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. He didn't feel a thing. <laughs> Speechless. <laughs> Typical. Oh no. Dude, I should have switched ghosts. I can't take my damage ghost seriously. I'm 
sorry. Listen, kid. This... This pain on you. This... This is what I get for... For playing nice. That's so sad. Oh, that's so sad. No. Oh, I hate this cutscene. This is where Zavala is a bitch and tries to tell us not yeah, to fight back. Worst. Even worse timing. I wanted to laugh. I really did. We should have been there. Yeah, you should have, Ikora. You should have been in a lot of campaign missions, but you know what? You just sit at the tower with this your bald ass. Point. This is on the head of Aldrin Sov. But if he thinks what he's done is the end, it's not. It's the beginning. We're going to fight him. Do you hear me? All of us, every Titan, every warlock, every hunter. We will take the reef by storm. And then we will mount the head of that son of a bitch on his precious throne. Damn right. Damn Fire right. Fire team. She's hyping all this up just for Zavala to be like, no. Watch. Watch Zavala's bitch ass. Look, look at this. No. no. Yeah. Shut up. What did you say? We are not an army. We are not conquerors. We are guardians. We need to keep our eyes here. On our home, our people, the traveler. The reef was lost the moment it lost its queen. So if another Sov wants a stretch of lifeless rocks, let him have it. This is Cade we're talking about. For us to do nothing is... is... Say it. Cowardice. That's right. She just called you a bitch. I refuse to bury any more friends. You won't have to. Oh. Oh, that's right. Aldrin Sov is mine. That's right. Oh, we better put a bullet in his head. Actually, we don't know. Petra might have done it. Spoiler alert. But either way, that motherfucker is dead. How are they just going to spawn you in at the tower and just like ex expect you to like be normal after what you just watched? Like day one Forsaken when you first played that, like, dude. Like, well, I couldn't, I don't even remember what was going through my head, but I just know I've not been the same since. Well, everybody, um, yeah, that was really nostalgic and really sad, but I think I'm gonna call it there for now for this episode or series. I don't know if I want to make this a series that I at least wanted to play through that part. If you want to see more of this campaign, let me know. I'll probably will play it eventually, but do with all the Witch Queen stuff coming out. I, I, I do need to prioritize that, but probably will have more forsaken campaign on the way i mean i do i did delete a whole ass character so now i gotta do all of this stuff and do all of uh this stuff oh dude oh that was it was worth that was worth it but yeah if you're new here 
please consider subscribing on the road to 1000 subs before which queen definitely probably won't happen but hey, a dreamer is gonna dream okay but with that being said as always if you made it this far i love your face and i'll be fine ladies and gentlemen have a great rest of your day